Novak Djokovic versus Lorenzo Musetti is the second semi-final for Wimbledon for 2024. Both players have had different roads to get to this stage. Musetti entered the tournament as the number 25 seed and will take on Lestian in the first round. And after dropping the first set, would fight back to win. 4-6, 7-6, 6-2, 6-2. In the second round, he take on countryman Dadiri. And this was a battle. After going down two sets of one, he fight back to win. 6-4, 4-6, 6-7, 6-4, 6-4. In the third round, he take on Common Sanya, who had beaten Rublev in the first round. And after splitting the first two sets, Musetti would win in four. 6-2, 6-7, 7-6, 6-3. In the fourth round, he take on the lucky loser Piracad, who had been a phenomenal player throughout this tournament. And after dropping the first set, Musetti would fight back to win. 4-6, 6-3, 6-3, 6-2, who advanced to the quarterfinals. In the quarterfinals, Musetti would take on Fritz, the number 13 seed, who had actually demolished him at Wimbledon a couple of years ago. And after going up two sets of one, Musetti would fight to win in the fifth. 3-6, 7-6, 6-2, 3-6, 6-1, to advance to the semifinals. Djokovic entered the tournament as the number two seed, and would take on the qualified Kripriva in the first round. There's no problem getting through in straights. 6-1, 6-2, 6-2. In the second round, he took the wild card Fernley. After dropping the third set, Djokovic would win in four. 6-3, 6-4, 5-7, 7-5. Five. In the third round, he take on Popperin, a man who had nearly played a five-setter against in Australia at the start of the year. And this was no different, with Popperin winning the first set and Djokovic fighting back to win. 4-6, 6-3, 6-4, 7-6 in his toughest match to date. In the fourth round, he take on Runa, the number 15 seed, who had just come back from two sets of love down in the previous round against Ellis. There's no problem for Djokovic getting through in straights. 6-3, 6-4, 6-2, to advance to the quarterfinals. In the quarterfinals, Djokovic would take on number nine seed Demonor, who had been injured in the previous match and was unable to play in this quarterfinal, handing Djokovic the walkover. These guys have played six times before with Djokovic leading 5-1 in their head-to-head -head, and of course having that epic match that they played a couple of weeks ago at the French Open with Djokovic getting through in five sets, but they've never played on a really quick court like this and they've never played on grass in general. So you'd think there would be advantage Novak on this surface going into this one with Musetti's experience on grass a lot less. If Musetti's going to win this one, he's got to be aggressive from the start. He can't sit back like he did against Fritz and just hope for errors because Djokovic isn't giving away errors. We saw that in the Runa match a couple of days ago. So he's going to have to be aggressive from the start and also serve well if he's going to be a chance of making his first final. If Djokovic's going to win this one, he just needs to keep doing what he's doing. Serve big and take over the baseline. He's been so much more aggressive this week than we're used to seeing because of that knee. And he also has been serving so much bigger than we're used to seeing as well. So he's going to have to serve well against Musetti and hope that Musetti doesn't really push him around. Maybe gets, gives him some errors like we see Musetti do it on occasions. Not the matchup that I expected in the semis, especially with Djokovic's knee and Musetti's, I guess, volatility when it comes to his form. But I have to go with Djokovic in four sets here. I mean, it's obviously grass courts, Djokovic, and he's come this far. So he must be feeling pretty good about himself. Got a little bit of a rest against uh, Demonor of course, not having to play him, but I've got to go Djokovic in four to make the final. Let me know down in the comments below who is making the final.